You can't even see where we came from, but. There were leeches. We are in Sequoia National Forest this weekend to explore some other awesome swimming holes, natural water slides, and maybe, if we're lucky, some cliff jump spots. So first up today, we're exploring Brush Creek, which is right below us now. There's actually two ways to get to Brush Creek. We're dropping down from the top of Sherman Pass Road, down a steep drop to get down to Brush Creek. You can also come up from the bottom, down by Brush Creek Campground. It's about a mile and a half upstream of the campground. But today, we're opting for a little bit of a tougher drop-in. So right now, it seems pretty dry in this part of Sequoia National Forest. It's traditionally pretty dry on this eastern side, so you don't see the big sequoias actually over on this side. But over here, you can see it's very shrub-like, very high desert-like, and it's pretty dry. So hopefully, Brush Creek is flowing. caught our first glimpse of water, I can hear it raging down there in the creek, so this is still kind of a sketchy uh, way down, so probably would not advocate going this way in the future. Probably up from the campground is the easier way for sure. So we just dropped in. From that steep cliff up there, you can't even see where we came from, but above that tree, steep drop loose. Might find an easier way to go back up, but we are down in the creek. So we're about a quarter mile upstream of the most popular swimming holes on Brush Creek. And as you can see, there's other little swimming holes and falls further upstream of that popular spot. Nobody here, even though the campground was crowded. Brush Creek is beautiful. There's lots of little pools and falls. We haven't even made it to the so-called main swimming holes on the slide yet. Even if we don't make it there, it's still amazing up here. We encountered one group of three guys headed upstream, but other than that, nobody else is here. So I found this, what looks to be a slide here. I don't think it's the official slide, but I'm gonna depth check this and slide it because it seems pretty slick. And this pool seems at least five feet deep, which should be enough. <laughs> so that was the first slide of the day. Kind of a short guy, but still fun. Great way to start the day off. The water's cold, but it feels so good on this warm granite slab. Ah. So we found what I believe to be the big slide on this. Just need to depth check it. There's definitely a jump off to the side here, but I think this is the biggest slide. So the bad news, I just depth checked this one and it's not deep enough to slide. However, just downstream of that one, we've got this giant, pristine granite bowl with a Bitch and slide, so that's what we're gonna do. Plan B. So this is the line. See what happens. Definitely wanna stay to the right. I don't wanna go to the left. So there's lots of little uh, insects, lots of little worms or bugs that covered us from the water. At first we were thought they were leeches because they were dark in color, but 
they're not adhering. They don't have like a big suction cup mouth like a leech, and they're not adhering to us. So if you do see those, I wouldn't be concerned about them. They're not, they don't appear to be leeches. So if you know what those are, drop me a comment down below. So that's a wrap on Brush Creek. Beautiful. This slide right here is sweet. Nice drop there. Couple other slides further up. That first baby slide we went on. That other kind of bang around slide we went on. Brush Creek, lots of slides, beautiful pools. Still flowing Labor Day weekend on this dry ass summer we've had so far. So instead of going back up the creek where we came from, the road is actually right up there. So we're gonna kind of bushwhack straight up to the road. And I think we found something that might be a trail there. So that's good to know for the future is, looks like there might be a pull off on that road where you can drop down next to this awesome pool right here where we had that slide where we were going head first off of. It's gonna be an easier hike out than it was dropping in for sure. So right here, there's some white markers and there's enough for like one or two cars pull out here. And you can see the pools directly below. However, this way is actually steeper than the way we dropped in from up there. So to be safe, I would recommend everyone that checks out this swimming hole and slides come from the campground and hike up the creek. That's the safest way to go. Because this was sketchy climbing out. Where we dropped in further upstream it was not as steep as this, but still sketchy going down. So be safe, park at the campground, hike up the creek. Brush Creek. Is that your concentration face? <laughs> but we're excited to explore. But we're. Exp but we're. Exp <laughs> Infamous. <laughs>